Hi guys and welcome to another video. So in this video we'll be talking about this new model. Let me just hide my test by. So uh, Meta AI, which was previously Facebook AI, uh, released a model. I don't think this model is a very available for everybody, but it's certainly more available than GPT-3. Okay. So this model called OPT uh, 7500B, which is a, a hundred, uh, 175 billion parameters model uh, that Meta AI is publishing will be via, will be available for more people to have access for. So the okay, I'm just gonna read um, pre, uh, just this. Uh, first paragraph to give you guys a hint of what we are talking about here. So large language models, natural language processing systems with more than 100 billion parameters have transformed NLP and AI research over the last few years. Trained on a massive and varied volume of tasks, they show some surprising new capabilities to generate creative tasks, solve basic uh, math problems, answer, reading comprehension questions, and more. So, the biggest uh, model uh, so far that actually we we now have bigger models than GPT-3, but GPT-3 was that huge step um, towards very large uh, models. Uh, I think the previous model was 17 billion parameters, so... GPT-3 was more than 10 times bigger than the previous model. And now we have some very big models. I'm going to make a video talk about um, some of them. But the focus of this video is this um, OPT-75B, okay, which is the model from Meta AI. So they are doing something similar to uh, what OpenAI did back in the day, which is limiting the the access to this model so following the publication guidelines for researchers generated by partnership on ai so they cannot i don't i think they cannot publish the, this model publicly yet uh someone might <laughs> might have to do that because of the implications i think this is kind of overblown a little bit so and even though <laughs> Even if you had access to the model, you wouldn't be able to run the model because this model is, you guys can see here, takes uh, 16 NVIDIA's V100 GPUs, which this alone is a, a fortune. So uh, AI nowadays is quite limiting uh, in this large scale, not just because of the access, that is limited for these huge models, but also uh, the compute power to to run these models. So I guess you can see, but they also have uh, smaller models. That you guys can see here that is a one hundred and twenty-five million, three fifty million, one point three, two point seven, six point seven, thirteen and thirty and sixty-six billion to be released. So. They are smaller versions, you guys can see him. Also, they are talking about uh, the impact of carbon footprint um, from for these models, um, which I think could be considered as well, uh, especially because of the power usage that we should we should strive to have a higher optimization with regards to that. So. That's it, guys. Uh, you guys can read the the website, and I should I think we should see something more about this in the near future. So this is just a news that I got, and I would like to share it with you guys. Okay, so thank you so much for watching this video. See you guys in the next one.